Hi guys, welcome back to the channel, Driving in Jamaica. This is part two of our University of Technology tour. We are on the compound of the University of Technology. And this is the, this section is where you find the residential dorms. Okay, on the left, that's one of the dorms, and as we drive up, you're going to see more. On the left is the Alfred Sangster Auditorium. I do believe we are breaking the one way but I just wanted to show you the dorms those the auditorium I mean now UTEC is the second largest university in Jamaica It's a very popular university, it used to be called CAST, but over the years the name was changed and as you can see it's a very nice facility, well laid out. It offers all the major courses from business to dentistry, it's a fully accredited university and I must say they've done an excellent job with it. Yeah, coming up on the left is the Burger King, that's on campus. Okay, I just saw a sign that said one way, so I'm not sure. Let's turn around. Oh, it couldn't be one way, the car's parked in this direction. But it says one way. Right, we're going to turn around. There's a sign that says one way. I'm not sure because this is where they should have the sign that says if it's a one way. I'm not sure it's a one way, but there's no sign up here to say one way. But we're gonna drive this way. It's like a credit union over there, like a bank. Actually, we're going to look at the School of Computing and Engineering. are part of the AC unit the fans basically the compressor for the AC units so this building doesn't seem to have central air that's why you have each office would have its own AC and every AC comes with the compressor unit outside okay so that was a faculty of engineering and computing So 
and I'll look at the building on the left. Okay, the roads up here are like Barbados Avenue, Trinidad Avenue, so I guess. But there's a Barbados Avenue in New Kingston as well. But the roads up here seem to be also named after Caribbean islands. I've never understood why they have two roads with the same name. Okay, this one is Dominica Crescent. In New Kingston, it's Dominica Drive. But we are on Barbados Avenue. And there's one over in New Kingston as well. Very strange. Okay, this looks like a bank or a Victoria Mutual Payment Center. Okay, we're passing the Burger King again. Back up to the one-way road. Okay, we're going to drive over to the other side of the campus now. And the road we're coming up on now is St. Lucia Avenue. Oh, they actually have a Jamaica Boulevard here. Oh, that's what New Kingston is missing. Very nice. Very nice, there it is. Very nice. So they are with the Times. They have a Jamaica Boulevard. Also have a St. Lucia Avenue up here. We had said in our previous video that Knutsford Boulevard should be renamed Jamaica Boulevard. So it's so nice to see a Jamaica Boulevard up here. But I'm, I'm still a little curious as to why would they have two Barbados Avenue, two St. Lucia Avenue. I mean, I don't get it. I mean, I know you have Kingston 5 and up here is probably another Kingston 6 probably, but still, you don't need two roads with the same name. Okay, this is another section of the campus now. Straight ahead on the left is the library. And then that open field, that's the sports grounds or the field. Okay, this car is supposed to go around the roundabout, but they decide to just cut here, but, ah oh boy. You would think on a college campus they would at least drive a little better. But they didn't want to drive around the roundabout so they just cut across. I don't know what is going to happen with the indiscipline on the roads but it's really bad. Alright guys, thanks for watching the video. Remember to like, share and subscribe. Have a good day.